Hey, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Big Ad Kicks, a.k.a. the UI General, and we are back with another review, and today we have a jersey on deck today. The pack has landed. If you haven't watched my last video, please go ahead and peep that. You know, I'm going to drop a little pop-up so you guys can press it. Check that out. I got the kicks to match this jersey. My jersey finally came in. I was hoping it was going to come in the same day. I got the kicks, but, you know, it didn't. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Turn those post notifications on. We are now over 800 subscribers, so I would like to thank each and every last one of you. I love y'all. Thank y'all. Now, let's go ahead and get into this review, and today we have a throwback Pete Rose Cooperstown collection. We have a throwback Phillies Pete Rose jersey, something I haven't seen too many of. You see, when you see the throwback Phillies jerseys, you usually see a lot of the Mike Smith, Steve Carlton's, Tug McGraws, but it's very rare you see the Pete Rose throwback. When you see a Pete Rose throwback, it's usually a Cincinnati Reds. So let's go ahead and check this out. You have the number he wore, number 14. As you can see, this is all stitched. This is an authentic and it's in my size, a size 52, which is a 2XL. Look at the tags, Cooperstown Collection. Has the serial numbers on there. Everything is correct. Have the official Mitchell Ness tag, you know, with the little rope. Stuff that connects to it. This is authentic. It is stamped. And this did retail for $250. Of course, I ordered this off of Fans Edge and I had a coupon. So use those coupons, people. Get some of these jerseys. Get some of the money off of these jerseys. And let's go ahead and review this thing, man. You have the Throwback Phillies logo right there. And you have the 1980 sold in right there in Pete Rose's name. Matter of fact, this is the colorway in Jersey from the 1980 World Series because the Phillies won the World Series in 1980. They won on game six. You know, Pete Rose, his nickname is Charlie Hustle. So you got to have the Charlie Hustle in the collection. And it has the zipper right there and just the overall overall quality of this jersey has a nice solid weight to it this is a very good fitting jersey it feels good to the hand and you have a cooperstown authentic collection badge right here for all my jersey heads of course you have the burgundy pinstripe burgundy and white pinstripe going down going down the side down to the sleeves on each side. Let's look at the back of the jersey. And of course you have Pete Rose's name stitched. Let you guys get a good look at the stitching. One of the better jerseys in my collection. Definitely I was glad I was able to, you know, put, get my hands on this piece. This is a jersey I always wanted even before the sneakers. So I have a few jerseys. And that's pretty much it, man. We're going to get this jersey put on. We're going to put this throwback Pete Rose on. And this is a hat that I picked up. This is not the Cooperstown collection hat. This is just an on-field throwback alternate. But it is in the Cooperstown colors. You know, if you look at the back, you can see that little bit of light blue back here in the back as well. Again, I did get it to go with the Iversons that I did a video on. So please check this out. I know the colors are a little off, but I don't care as long as that burgundy hits. It is all right with me. So I know what we do around this time. Jerseys and kicks get rocked every day around here, B. Come on, man. We're going to take this throwback Phillies. We're going to take this to the streets, man. We're going to put it on. Gonna put the hat on, and we're gonna put these kicks on. And we're 
We're going to show how it looks. Stay tuned. So we have this jersey on, and I must say, I'm definitely feeling the quality in this piece. You can feel it when you have it on. And the sneakers are nice, good touch, a nice addition to go with this jersey. I love the color placement that Reebok has put on these. Dope. A nice nod to the Cooperstown jerseys of this era. Man, the sewing, the patches, the twill, everything about this jersey feels great. I will be copping some more Mitchell and Ness baseball authentic jerseys to have in the collection. I have a few that I'm bringing you guys, but man, this is just one of my favorite jerseys. The hat I got is okay as well, even though it's not the Cooperstown, but I'll take it. So what do you guys think in the comments, man? Is this jersey a sneaker combo? Is it a go or is it a no? Let me know. Hey, man, if you made it to the end of this video, give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. And that's right, ladies and gentlemen, bang that notification bell. You know the motto. I'm wild. You wild. We all wild, baby. Stay fly. Stay fresh. And most importantly, stay safe. And I'm out, y'all.